Hey traders, it's Jeffrey from Ninja Caters. Today I'm going to show you one of my favorite secret features in Ninja Trader. Now, most of you, if not all of you, enter your trades on the chart trader, and so do I. However, when I'm in a trade, especially with multiple contracts, and I want to take one contract off to take some profit, there's really no easy way in chart trader to close a single contract without changing all of the settings of your ATM. So here's an easy solution how to do that. And I do it using the basic entry window. Now, many of you have never even opened or heard of this window. So here's where to find it and what to do. First, after you've got your chart open to the instrument that you want to trade, just like this, and you've got chart trader open with the ATM that you're using, for example, I've got a, uh, a six quantity, 28 take profit, 120 stop, three step stop strategy um, on my ATM. So it's a quantity of six, okay? Once you've got everything open to the setting that you want, okay, go to your control panel. Here, let me pull this down. Click on new and choose basic entry. That's gonna open up a window that's just for entering orders, okay, that many of you may not have even tried using before. Now, here's the most important thing. After you've got your chart open to the instrument that you want um, and, and uh, the ATM is open, you leave all of that the same, okay? What The first thing you need to do is right-click on the basic entry window and choose Always on Top. That way it's not going to get hidden behind your chart, okay? Um, now, here's the most important part. In Chart Trader, when you've got everything set with multiple contracts, you don't want to touch that. But in your basic entry window, first select the same instrument, okay? Here we're on the NQ, we're on the NQ. Let's see. Actually, we are on the MNQ. There we go, okay? And we are in a sim and q account okay so make sure everything lines up choose the same atm strategy that way it's going to adjust the stops and the take profits for you but reduce your quantity down to one okay so let's give it a try all right let's go ahead and get into a long trade it looks like the market wants to retest the edge of that zone there and as soon as we get in the money a little bit we'll go ahead and take one off and make sure after you place your trade on chart trader that you reset your quantity down to one that's what we need to do so we want to take one off we're in a long trade so we're going to hit sell and you can see how easily brings it down to five and adjusts our take profits and our stop loss. Want to take another one off? Oh, let's fix that. That's part of my ATM. You want to take another one off? Let's hit sell again. That's how easy it is, okay? And what if you want to scale in? Hit buy. Well, let's do it right at market. Okay, and we're back up to five. We've got a stop of five, and we are good to go. Hit another one, we're back up to six, okay? That's how you, met, you can move one contract at a time without affecting your ATM, okay? So once your trade is on the chart and you're using Chart Trader, remember, open your basic entry window. Make sure you keep your ATM and your order quantity the same on Chart Trader, but in the basic entry window, same ATM, quantity of one, and easy, click and add or subtract as many or as few as you want, real time. That way you can actually work your trade much more effectively, okay? So if the trade's ripping in your favor and you wanna to add to your position, scale in. If you wanna take some money off the table, scale out. This is how you can do it. That's it traders, an easy way to take some quick profit and scale in and out when you're in the money or when a trade is really ripping in your favor. Good trading, and I'll see you in the next one.